Hey Scorpio, this is Tara Queen Jamila. You're to do your uh, three card lovers quickie reading for March 2018. Um, so welcome to the channel. If you are new, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Uh, if you've been here, thank you so much for the support. Hit the thumbs up. Uh, if you guys need a private reading, the link to my website is below. So let's just get started. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be using the Dark Angels Tarot deck. So I hope that you guys like this. I hope that you guys are able to see the illustrations close up. <laughs> it does kind of blur itself when you zoom in. So uh, hopefully you guys will be able to see everything clearly. Okay. So I am going to uh, lay out the cards. I'm going to keep them face down and read the cards one by one. Okay. So I am going to call to the spirits and spirit guides for the Scorpios, okay, for the lovers only, for people in relationships. What are the energies overall for the month of March 2018? Uh, I am going to only read with three cards, okay? So if you guys need any more clarification, you can go and look because there will be other lovers readings that are going to be going up in the month of March, okay? Um, all right, show me uh, Scorpio and then uh, the overall relationship and then Scorpio lover. Okay, for the month of March 2018. All right, thank you. Okay, I am done and I'm going to go ahead and lay the cards out for you. Okay. So, Scorpio, let's look at your card. Scorpio's got the Knight of Wands. So, I feel as though overall for the month, I feel like Scorpio is feeling very, very passionate. Very passionate, okay? If you are the lover of a Scorpio during the month of March, you are just being bombarded with a lot of love and protection and you know possibly sex and, and just love and intrigue okay uh now looking at the overall relationship you got the <laughs> king of wands so more passion I feel like overall the relationship has you know been through many many changes but i feel as though overall there's a lot of passion in the month of March, a lot. So, you know, all of these court cards are definitely showing. Now, first of all, Scorpio, you probably, you may have a fire sign lover. Let's look at your lover. Your lover is represented by the Wheel of Fortune. Perfect. So um, I do feel as though a lot of you are possibly just now like a lot of you are going to be, um, feel like getting back together or either maybe even new relationships, you know, uh, you know, if you are in an old relationship that's been, you know, happening for quite some time, the relationship is definitely being renewed. Okay. So there's, there, there's a, there's a spark or a flame that is actually being rekindled okay there's a flame that's being rekindled now i will tell you that all of that passion and and newfound love the will of fortune could represent a possible baby blessing so <laughs> y'all better be careful with that because you know i you know i just the knight and the king of wands i just see a lot a lot of sex just a lot of and, and you know what? I feel as though if, if any of you are with a Scorpio, they are really, really, really hyper-focused on you. Okay? They are really, really feeling very passionate. Overall, the King of Wands does represent the relationship being at a very stable place. feel like your lover is, you know, a lot of good things is happening. I see a lot of good spirits around your lover, Scorpio. Um, the wheel, what is the Zodiac association to the wheel of fortune? Uh, cause the wheel is actually related to a Zodiac sign. So let's see. I can't always remember them. Now I will tell you that I'm seeing a fire sign. It's probably, I just want to see because maybe some of you 
Uh, I just like to kind of read deeper into the situation. Okay, uh, the Wheel of Fortune is symbolized by the fixed signs of the Zodiac, the Taurus, the Scorpio, the Leo, or the Aquarius, okay? So, you know, it could be any any of those signs could be your lover. But overall, I feel as though, you know, in in March, I feel like, you know, the especially if you're married, uh, you know, I feel like the, the house is protected. I feel like things are happening, things are getting done. Um also, I'm sort of seeing, again, uh, the, like just with that fertility thing, okay? And, and I don't really have a lot of time to, because I wanted to make these quick. So, you know, you may even be looking at some kind of astrological association with maybe your next child, okay? If you were to do the, the, the math, possibly, I don't know, I think it would... Uh, or I, I don't know, you know, but I am definitely seeing a possible uh, child coming out of the wheel. Okay, uh, wheel of fortune can definitely, and and I can see with the with those with that knight of wands and that king of wands. Now, another thing that I will tell you is that I definitely do see something being created, whether or not it's it just looks like it's good energy. Uh, fate and destiny, I do feel as though you're going to be definitely, you're going to be looking at your lover as if you are destined to be with them. So if you're with a Scorpio, they're definitely going to be into you in the month of March. Okay. So yeah, that's what I'm saying. There's a whole lot of in between in there, but I just feel like overall, just the overall energies for the Scorpio lovers is good. Okay. All right. Again, stay tuned for other readings, more detailed readings that are going to be coming up. This is just an overview quickie. Um, if you do have any concerns about your relationship, the link to my website is below. You can definitely come and get a uh, psychic reading. It is based upon what's, you know, looking into the future, but also I am an empath. So I can tell you how your lover feels, okay, <laughs> which is really a good thing. But right now I'm seeing, you know, the, and, and and you know what? It may be a change to where they're at. And so your lover coming up as the wheel does kind of represent them having to deal with that change because it's like, wait a minute, do I need to pinch myself? So I do. But overall, I see a lot of happiness, a lot of passion. OK, thank you so much for watching Scorpio and Scorpio Lover. I'll see you guys later. Blessed be.